What's up, Helldivers? Welcome to the Salt Divers Podcast. We are back for your weekly update. We've got a lot to talk about. A lot, actually. We had a video drop. Was that this morning that the news just dropped? Yeah, yeah it, was, it was this morning. About freedom's escalation? Yeah, when, we're, when we're sleeping. Yeah. You know, because everything cool happens when we're asleep. Wow. Wake up. The, the, everybody on YouTube's got their videos out already, you know. So it's like, <laughs> it's like 7 a.m. for us. Stati- like, status quo around here at the Salty Nerd. <laughs> I'm not making a video at 7 a.m. We'll, Get out of we'll here. We'll put it out there in a week. <laughs> no big deal. Anyway, what's up, Dutch? How you doing, hey, man? Hey, man, I'm good. All right. So just to get this out of the way, we do have the escalation of freedom. Escalation topic. of freedom. That's a that's a big one. That's going to be a big topic. What a, what a name. That's a good name. Uh, we've got a, a an article from videogamer.com with a, a player count update. And then we've got our, yeah, thanks. We've got our major orders that we're talking about. And we'll also be doing some viewer comments, it looks like. My notes are extensive. Yeah, you haven't looked at any of them. I, this is my first time. <laughs> because, looks good. you know, you prepare. You're preparing like I prepare. Except yeah. for somehow I'm making the notes and you're not reading them. So, F you, man. <laughs> <laughs> now you know how Katie feels. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of annoying. See? It really is. <laughs> I'm a, all right. I'm a, I get it. <laughs> I get it, man. You were unprepared. <laughs> I'm very prepared. All right, let's talk about this. Uh, uh, escalation of freedom. You just want to like go right off the top of that one? Yeah, why not? You want to like drag it out a little bit, make them make make the people get, complain about clickbait titles. Do you want to wait? No, I don't care. Talking about escalation of freedom is fine. No, we we just watched the video. Literally, yeah. I just watched it ten seconds ago. Yeah. Um, they've got some. Some, some stuff in the works for August 6th. August 6th. Big update on August update. 6th. How buggy do you think that motherfucker It's going to be unplayable. <laughs> <laughs> All this new shit is going to be so broken. They, they haven't fixed their whole shit yet. <laughs> <laughs> It's like all nope. we want, guys. All we want is a working social menu. Yeah, that's it. That's all we. That's we we would have been thing. happy. That's not they didn't even list. talk about they it. Talk about it at all. They, God. Like, all this stuff coming at you. <laughs> all right, cool. All right. Can't wait to play solo. Man, I can't wait to <laughs> not talk to anybody. <laughs> oh, no, I'm, I'm sure. sure I'm sure. Fine. You know, it's probably all bundled up into this. I hope. Yeah. You know, yeah. so, I mean, there's a, the new fiery war bond that they're talking about, too. Yeah. Freedom's Flames coming know, whatever out soon. It's, whatever it's called. Ish. Freedom's Flame. Yeah. Bam, bam, Bigelow. <sighs> I'm going to say war this, bond. though. Um, they are giving way more attention to the bugs. On um, as far as like missions and stuff, are they like? Well, yeah, like oh wait, we had the TCS towers. Yeah, we got the Meridia mission. Then we got Black now Gold. we're getting this new like steal a child thing for the yeah. buck side. Yeah, yeah, which is a new mission in the uh, Escalation of Freedom. Uh-huh. Where we have to steal a baby larva. Go kidnap a go k- kidnap you a to, grub. You have to kidnap a grub, and then Sweet. it screams the entire time you're kidnapping it. It's like you want to go like like try to take like a puppy away from its mom. Yeah. They're going to be mad. They're going to be really mad. They're going to be upset. And then the mama <laughs> is going to be real mad too. And they're going to be justifiable in their in their acid <laughs> like, I'm stealing your baby. It's like, oh, no, now you're at lunch. <laughs> yeah. I don't even blame them. Yeah. But you notice they didn't they All of our all of our missions on bug side are like kind of gray area. Yeah. We're, we're a little we're we're kind of <laughs> shit bags. We're going to do some <laughs> shitty we're things to these bugs. We're steal your baby and do experiments on it. <laughs> <laughs> That's so bad. <laughs> And I'm all, yes. But I'm like, go. I'm looking at this video and they're like, yeah, we got this new bug mission where you have to steal a baby. And I'm like, okay, but like, what, do we have any new missions for the you know, freaking bot side? The, the, well, there's stuff. There's, there's, there's stuff. stuff. There's a new bite base type. Is it, looks well, it looks like we're, we're going to be going in there and killing these giant bases. Yes. Which is which I'm all for. about as close as to it. urban warfare as I think you're going to get right now. <sighs> for now, it's fine. But it looks pretty cool. But with extra rewards. Extra base equals that. extra rewards. Yeah, if you take down the massive base, you get. But if you're if you're capped, do you get rewards? Or are they gonna up the the cap on the things? They, so we can buy the stuff. If they want to maintain the caps for <laughs> for metals and requisition chips and samples and all, if they're gonna leave the cap there, then we need to have something else to work. Are we gonna with. are they gonna introduce a new? Uh, currency type we have enough currency types yeah we have we just need to use the ones that we have we need stuff to spend it on and we and we need caps on the the stuff that we can save yeah easy enough so we'll figure it out but i'm uh, bigger enemy outpost cool so the one obviously i'm more interested in is bot side so it looks like from the video that they shared looks like you have an isr on sitting there inside of a giant base that was just a big giant generic base giant base they're gonna they're gonna take those those uh 
city blocks they're just gonna like put them together like tetris pieces and you're gonna they should. To go through them they should you know that's fine that's tough though. it's it's I think it's fun. I like yeah. going into bases, you know. That's one of the best parts is like, oh, there's a, like a heavy base. So you got two tanks yeah. and, you know, four or five different fabricators and you got to go in there and blow them <laughs> It's going to be in some giant bot city. It's going to have. That's what. It's going to have warship or airship fabricators. Dude, and if we get to Cyberstan and it's not. All kinds of stuff. It's not just like an entire freaking Coruscant. You know what it's I mean? It's going to be surrounded by jammers. And, <laughs> oh, and, and, jammers are the worst. <laughs> 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 they suck so bad. <laughs> Um, bug uh, missions or, or bug, yeah, bu you know, bugs are going to have bigger bases I'm, as well. I'm kind of, I'm almost feel like I'm sure I should be like sympathetic towards the bugs. We, we kind of treat them like shit. We yeah, just, we, we, un, grind, we grind them up for fuel. They're undemocratic. We steal, we steal their babies. You know, we <laughs> suck them through black holes. <laughs> it's like, they didn't do nothing. They're just, they're just bugs. Bug like, sympathizer. They, Dutch butters is a bug, bug sympathizer. sympathizer. <laughs> I mean, I'll kill him. I have no problem killing him. <laughs> I mean, but, I'll kill you know, him. We're, we're, we're kind of dicks to him, you know? Yeah, yeah absolutely. <laughs> uh, new environmental hazards. This is a good one. So the, the Dagobah mission, it sounds yeah. like they want to try and spook it up. Yeah. Uh, which means there's going to be lightning and rain and fog and, and well, there's more. A new, there's a new uh, swamp biome. Yeah. In there, in there, Listen. Which looks kind of cool. If they're going to do this, I I'm cool with it, but I want better stealth mechanics then. Like if it's rainy and foggy and I can't see shit, those goddamn bugs better not be able to see me. Well, they 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 did say, well. They said for the acid rain. For the acid rain. The acid rain stuff. lowers the armor rating. Of everything. Of everything. Including and you. Them. So. so that'll be, that's, an in, that's an interesting little twist. I mean, I guess yeah. it makes sense. Yeah, unless you wear a special type of armor that is like maybe we'll get acid these, resistant. Maybe we'll get something like that. I'll take an acid resistant armor. Acid resistant armor, fire resistant armor. Maybe some maybe some yeah. armor with some like you know heat pads inside it. For heat snow. pads for this. Heat, heat padded armor. Just get your hands in your Yo, pocket. Yeah. Uh, it's like, <laughs> Dutch, why are all your heat pads in your underwear? <laughs> it's like, it's like, I need to stay warm. <laughs> Got to keep the boys happy, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Got to keep the boys happy. <laughs> Uh, it just, it looks like they've, oh, a new difficulty level. We got to talk level about 10. that. Level 10. Level 10 is coming. Yeah. Level 10. Like, I, I don't, <laughs> I don't feck around with, uh, with, uh, suicide missions a whole lot. We did play a little bit of a suicide mission last night. That was fun. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I like to end it. I like to end it on a nine in the, in the, in the stream on a nine, see if yeah. we win or if we lose, you know, pretty good so far. It was fun. We have to warm up. Yeah. We're not like these crazy people who just run nines all the time. We, yeah. we have to warm up to them. I got to go in at like a six or a seven. Yeah. And, work, and then as we kind of get loose and get our dynamics start down, working. <laughs> and then we start ranking it up a little yeah. bit to, to level nine. But now we have level 10, which according to the video, they said it's going to feel like a level 10. Great. And we have a new enemy. It's like awesome. a tentacle beast. Yeah. It pops out of the sand ah. and it like freaking slaps There's you. There's all kinds of new stuff. Kraken. That looks terrifying. Some kind of new armored freaking Armor chicken charger. Walker. Oh, the chicken walker with, with rocket launchers on it. Flamethrowers and missiles and shit. Oh, a new I, tank I, with rocket launchers, yeah. like anti-air tank. Look, that's man. just what we need. The bots need is, is another tank. <laughs> that's Great. what bots need is more freaking damage. Yeah. Yeah. I would love to see some, uh, I don't know. I, I want to rain hell. Uh, I need some new stratagems if we're going to be going up against. Yeah. Like that. But here's, here's the thing, you know, we got all this cool stuff coming out. We got this new, Escalation of freedom ex expansion. We got the the what's what is it again? The fire thing. Uh, freedom's flame. We got freedom's flame war bond someday. Um, <laughs> we, we you know there's a lot of stuff coming out, but here's the problem: um, the player base is down to less than ten thousand people. Not consistent. It's that's still. But they like they they time, they broke the line. Every time I log they, in, they broke at the least line. thirty or forty thousand people. But playing. but still, the 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 we're going on yeah. that downward trajectory, yeah. and you know we're going to have a spike, but then it's going to go down again because mm -hmm. people are going to go, oh, this is too hard, or this is just more of the same shit, you, you know, or or whatever. And um, I don't know if this is going to be enough to to save the game. Because I'll I'll tell you, I'm going to be straight up. I'm getting a little bored with this game. Yeah. I'm for real. You know, um, what's it been? Three, two, 200 hours? I, I, hours for I, you? Something like that. And I know you're like a psychopath that I'm at like 450 yeah. or something. And, um, but there's other games out there yeah. that, that are, that are, that are calling me and my game time is limited, you, you know? So I'm going to have to like figure out 
if um, this stuff is 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 worth it because I'm I want to I want to scratch that itch and, and go try some some other stuff out. There's a lot of games I have there I haven't played. Right. And um, I agree. I don't know if if this is going to be enough to bring that player base back. Hmm. You, you know what I'm saying? I don't think we're ever going to get back to the the what five hundred thousand. No, 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 that's no. Gone. That's gone. Not at all. That was a that was a flash in the pan, uh, viral moment for the game. Right. Where they made a ton of money, you know, I think in order to get people to keep coming back, they're gonna need. I I think they're gonna to a point they're gonna need to add like customization or something. They, they need to do something. They need to do some kind of a hey, if you play this mission, you get this special thing, kind of like the Malevolon Creek yeah. cape. Yeah, like if the only time you could ever get that cape is if you played Malevolon right. Creek. Right. It, nobody else can get it. Nobody else can get. It. If you got the game after that whole happened, you're yeah, not like gonna get it. Stuff. So there's like, there's going to have to be, and I don't want them to use this as a tactic to like con people into playing the game, but there has to be a fear of missing out. The FOMO. Absolutely. There has to be a little bit of FOMO involved. And Otherwise has, people are going to be like, well, whatever, I'll just play Yeah, yeah, I'll play just, whatever. you know, I'll, I'll just uh, yeah. log in and get my free medals and buy the stuff. And, yeah. yeah, I just, uh, I agree. I agree. You know, I, I was, I was thinking about this game. The, it doesn't give you a lot of reason to log in every single day. You, you know, um. I, I like to play games where you have a reason to log on. You know, if if if, if there's nothing to do in your main storyline, there's always, you know, like like I've said a hundred times, you know, like in World of Warcraft, you can go grind reputations, you can go grind achievements out, you know, yeah. some of the hundreds of achievements or, or or you know, there's always that quest line out there that that you've never finished. You know, because there's I, thousands of them. Yeah. And and there's there's just nothing in this game is makes me really want to come back other than the the mo which to me like this week is a perfect example right now we're in the middle of a okay guys go kill a billion bucks it's the freaking laziest are, are thing you, ever. It's, it's the laziest <laughs> shit ever yeah it, it's just like yeah i know listen i know you guys they're all building the escalation of freedom and blah 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 but go kill a billion bucks fuck you okay <laughs> just why are we killing a billion bugs? Because the scientists need more bug juice. Oh, okay. okay. Well, we're the, gonna kill the, a billion bugs regardless. It's, yeah. You gotta give us something. To, so this. It's just I'm, I'm a, not. I'm not happy with this. With this mo. There's a two two parts. It's, to this. It's, it's just. It's really sad. They need to get these narratives. Yeah. To a point where. Oh man, I want to be a part of that. Right. The, 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 like, the tower missions, the Meridia mm -hmm. mission. The, uh, we've never had anything like that on bot side nope. besides the like save the children one. I feel we I need feel, to have better narratives that bring people in and say, oh, I want to be a part of that one thing where we march towards Cyberstan right. and we take it. I feel or, like or uh, we build this, this new super base or whatever. Like right. we need storylines that get people engaged. I, I feel like they have, have writers. I feel like they have writers who are good at writing, you know, descriptive fluff pieces, you know, <laughs> you, you, you know, like, yeah. you, you know, it's like, you yeah. know, blah, 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 blah. But they don't have storytellers in, in their writing crew. Right. If they even have a writing room, I'm assuming they have a writing room. They must have something. They got to have something set up. Go, go find some guys that have written some books, some science fiction, some shit. science fiction authors, some yeah. guys that know how to set a narrative that know how to, you know, tell a story and, and something that they can plan far in advance. You, you, you know, it's just like just throwing a bunch of shit at us. It's like, here's a new tank type. Here's a new armor type. Here's a new biome. It's like, okay, but why? Why do we have these things? What's the, what's the reason? Yeah. We need a story. We need something to we invest need, in. We need a reason to, to want to play. Yeah. And, you know, go kill a billion bugs. Okay. <laughs> you know, it's, it's fine for, for a couple of streams. But you know why are we? Why I, it's just I, I I find it lazy. I I find it. It's like hey, we're we're still on vacation here, so I'm gonna suck up the next five to seven days with this stupid billion bug order. You know I don't think it's gonna take that long. No, yeah, it's, I don't know. I don't have any idea. But you know what I'm saying, right? I know exactly what you're saying. Yeah, and I th I don't think I'm alone. So no, I think. Um, a, a narrative story that people can get attached to is the most important thing that this this game needs. It needs yeah. another Meridia. It needs to have consistent missions that get people interested in, okay, oh, there's actually an end game for this. Oh, there's yeah. actually like a reason for doing these things instead mm -hmm. of just like, oh, we, you know, we liberated three planets on Bugside. Let's go back to bots again and take a couple planets over there and just yeah. kind of bounce back and forth. That's fine. That's the gameplay loop. 
but there has to be some kind of an overarching story that we're being told I, and we're playing yeah. through. Win or lose, there has to be a reason why we're doing these things. And lately, there just hasn't been. Well, no, nothing you know, since Meridia. On has the been bot like side, though, this week, we did have a really good the MO, the MO before this one that we're on now, the, the Go Kill a Billion Bucks. Oh, split the split, battle lines. Split the battle lines. That made sense. Yeah. There was a reason to do that. There's yeah. a tactical reason. Yeah. And that was that was a fun. And then we doubled mission. down on it, and they yeah. were like, "Okay, now keep taking those." Dude, planets. that was that was like one of the best demos we've had. Yeah, on, on bot side because gets, there was there was a reason to do it. Yeah, and yeah. we barely did it. But by the there was like RT, twenty like two hours. minutes left. There was yeah. like it was like 30, 20, 30 minutes. Really? Yeah, it was really close. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. and it was uh, it was it was it was fun. It was like you know it made it makes a difference until you know they don't want it to make a difference anymore. You know, we half most of the bot planets are are, are at that zero percent retention rate or whatever, and we should be going over there and taking all those planets on the on the bots side that they have. Right. But no, as soon as that demo got over, everybody went back over to bugs. <laughs> but everybody. But I, I will give it. them a little bit of credit. The, the 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 diehard bug divers did come over in some part to push that over the edge. Yeah. To exactly what we needed. So that was that was. That was pretty cool to see. Yeah, and, uh, as of as of right now, there's thirty two thousand players, thirty four thousand yeah. players ish uh, on the game. Yeah, that's really low. Most of them are on bug side, mm-hmm. which is where the major which order, is where the major order, and that's where they should be right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, but but still, like again, there's no real reason for us to complete this major order other than just but, you know Vega Bay, Beryllia Five, Istotu. All those planets need to be just, they need to be taken. <laughs> and there's less than a thousand bugs or less than a thousand divers between those three planets right now. Yeah. It's not going to do anything. <laughs> it's useless. Like they'd be better off if they all teamed up and went to one place. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so there needs to be, I'm going to say it again. I'm going to sound like a broken record, but there needs to be a, um, a narrative. Yeah. A strong narrative. A not, better, not a better a, narrative. Not just a busy work narrative. Like, oh, mm-hmm. go kill this and go take that one planet. It's like, no, we need to know. Why are we doing it? Mm-hmm. What's the reason? What's what's the outcome? What's going to happen after that? You know, even get us involved. Even way back in the day, you know, these 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 games were story driven. Like remember, like Command and Conquer, Red mm-hmm. Alert, those games. Yeah, yeah. there was a campaign we, 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 there was a campaign to it. There was cutscenes. Yeah, there was a narrative, and and we, we knew see- we knew what and why we were doing what we were doing. You, you know what I mean? Can, and, can you imagine how hyped and, people would get if they started like dedicating a little bit of time to do like like um, promotional videos that they put oh, out God. where it's like be- not behind the scenes, but like in game in story, kind of like the, the opening scene when you first turn the game on mm-hmm. where it's like a bunch of hell divers on a planet blowing shit up. Yeah. They had like little mini short movies like oh, that. Be awesome. But it would be them. Yeah. Like uh, we have to go like, here's this hell diver team that just got completely massacred on this mm-hmm. one planet. We have to go rescue them and get vengeance or whatever. And like, we could watch this little cut scene with this little, you know, Leroy Jenkins type, commando unit out there just getting their shit kicked in <laughs> like that like that news guy on a on a starship troopers yeah like, yeah something like that like they had news articles or news videos from the front <laughs> of, of people dying and shit like that like how fun would that be there's there's some uh there's um some fan-made movies coming out now for hell yeah. where people are like doing stuff like that oh the there's community one, the community's putting out some really fun stuff yeah there's Music, there was one that was like full cgi it looked great i love the cartoons that are the out cartoons there. are all, yeah those little goofy cartoons yeah. that look like uh like yeah. minions or whatever <laughs> yeah i could use some of that but anyway i don't want to beat a dead horse no i don't want to sound like i don't like this game because i do i love this game this is a super fun game but yeah. we just need you know Go forward. We need to move. We need some things a little bit need better. That. Need a little seasoning. Need a little seasoning. A little salt, a little salt and pepper on there. A little salt and pepper. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. What else we got? We were talking about the major order. So we barely made it with the last one. Yeah. And now this one is just churning out because everybody lo- everybody on this game loves killing bugs for some reason. I don't and know. I feel like they've turned the bugs up. You know, we were, on, so? we were on like a level six last night and it, we killed a ton of bugs. They're just like spawning everywhere. Mm. You know. Oh, I was, I did a I mean, we were on a level six. I think we killed like freaking five bio titans on one mission oh yeah it was it was crazy yeah. it was just like jesus christ where where <laughs> why are these you know it was, it was nuts dude i went i went i soloed a level nine this week on bug side just to piss you off i'm like all right fine this guy thinks i don't fight bugs fine i'm doing level nine and um, yeah, but then you didn't stream it there's no proof of it out there you didn't you didn't do anything to back yourself up you he's like push to push the play button 
and put it on the channel, I'm bro. On my laptop at home. <laughs> I got my ass kicked, but I did win. I love uh, our little we, we, our little banter. <laughs> I feel like we get annoyed with each other. I don't. I'm not really feel like. Oh man! So the low, yeah, we had the lowest player count ever. Apparently, a couple nights ago. I I don't know. I I don't know how much I believe in that stuff because every time I log in, there's at least forty thousand people playing. Every time. So I don't know where they get. Maybe if it's in the middle of the night when most of the U.S. is sleeping, and that's where most of the. I I sent the comment to you that said, you know. more people watch our podcast that are playing the game right now. I don't know if that's true or not. <laughs> we, got, uh, we have more know. views on this last week's episode <laughs> that are playing the game right now. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> that's, our tiny I little, think that's horse shit. I don't know, man. Because uh, our, 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 you know, that guy, the Buzz Lightbeer guy, he gets hundred, you know, hundred thousand yeah. views yeah, on yeah, his yeah. video. That's not every player plus some. No, people are just watching. No, but, and these are these are the people. These are the people that are going to come back once the new once the new stuff comes, expansion starts rolling comes out. out yeah yeah and so. they'll play for three days and then they'll go back to out. unless they hook the, them with a good narrative right so if you get these players to come back because you put something new in the game then you got to <laughs> hook them yep. and get them invested in the story of the game and then once the story's there then you got right. then you got people coming back because they want right. to see how the story plays out that's my idea this is true but what am I I'm not a game developer I don't know I'm fucking <laughs> uh, okay are we ready to do loadout of the week? Or yeah, do, you know, I, yeah? Need to, I need to talk. About, I don't have really a loadout of the week, but I do. This, uh, I feel like we've done this one before. Well, this is this is this is kind of like my new thing. This is your thing. So I, I had a uh, uh, somebody on Discord approach me. I'm going to say Naked Ape 77 is the dude's name. And um, he goes, hey, I wanted to just suggest this loadout for you. And he threw me some stuff. And, and uh, this is kind of what I came up with. It's kind of mostly what he said, but it's kind of a hybrid. And this is my bug loadout right now is a, a breaker incendiary shotgun. Sure. That's almost cheap mode. Okay. It, it really is. That's a crazy, bah, 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 bah. you just fire everywhere. Right. It's pretty fun. Um, grenade pistol. Yep. Um, out I, I will take the senator sometimes, but I like the grenade pistol because it's fun for taking bug holes out, you know, mm-hmm. um, and stun grenades. Stun grenades are the thing that's new to me. I like impact grenades. I like to throw them. I want them to see them blow up immediately as soon as I throw them at something. Yeah. So the, the stun grenades though, are weird because you know they just er, they stun people but the, the, like i i'm learning a new way to play the game right now with the stun grenades and then i take the uh the the grenade launcher and a supply pack and, and a rocket sentry and um holy cow <laughs> it's interesting it's mm-hmm. a very interesting way to play the game completely different completely different than my laser beam build yeah, which is what I normally go with, but I think that's better for bot side personally. But, but uh, the, the grenade launchers. Inter- I'm. How many grenades does a freaking charger eat to blow oh, it up? Oh, a charger? Yeah, a lot. It's insane. Yeah, you're not taking a charger. It's down with insane. Grenade launcher. And uh, you know, I'm. You need a I pumped like rifle. twelve of them into a bio titan yeah. last night. And didn't do good. shit. No, it's not good. <laughs> I'm like, good lord, man! It's not, it's not <laughs> enough. It's not enough, man. No, with those bigger and, enemies, you need a recoilless yeah. uh, or not? Uh, yeah, the recoilless rifle. So that big thing, just gunk. one yeah. shot to the head will kill a charger. One or two shots to a bio yeah. titan. There's, there's on the stream last night. If you go look, there's, there's a one time where I'm just like pumping grenade after grenade after grenade into a freaking. Titan. And they just he, eat he, it. Yeah. Two spits it out. Yeah. <laughs> you know, basically is what it does. <laughs> he hocked to you. He hocked to you. Yeah, yeah. But uh, no, I, I'm having fun with this build though because it's just it's just teaching me a new way to play. And uh, you you know, and of course, I'll go switch out that sentry with mm-hmm. my with with the with the rover sometimes, and all of a sudden my kill count doubles. <laughs> but you know, it's silly. But I would like to. I would like to see um like drones being introduced. Can you imagine if you, you have like a little call down a little computer yeah. and it has and you say I want I don't know you launch like ten drones into the air yes yeah. and, like and they that. go and they they seek out enemies and they just freaking fly into them and blow yeah. up how cool would that be pretty cool that'd be little that'd suicide be drones little Kamikaze suicide drones. drones yeah Kamikaze drones yeah bro yeah that's a take note <laughs> put that one in the notes I want to uh, see some Kaz- Kamikaze drone uh, orbital strike or something like that. But I, you know, you throw that stuff together with like a engineering kit armor. You know, there's, there's a get, my get, favorite get, get, armor. Yeah, my favorite armor is called Drone Master. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. So I'm like, I want a freaking drone. Yeah. I well, want you, like a little, yeah, a little thing have. that I can call down. I go do 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 do, and it, mm-hmm. it just sends yeah. like thirty drones out there and kills a bunch of stuff. I like it. It's a great idea. 
That's a great idea. It's a great idea. All right. Uh, the commandos get nerfed, I heard. Oh, uh, but I heard a rumor. That was all week long until the, the news came out today about the new expansion. But um, I guess all along they were saying that the commando was never meant to be able to one-shot the fabricators and that uh, the discussions are going on behind the scenes to maybe nerf it or not. I, I, I Please don't. Don't nerf it. Don't. You know, you guys have given us something fun. You've given us something fun. We're used to playing with it now. Yeah. If you take it away, it's just gonna it's, piss everybody it's, it's off. just going to piss everybody off, and you're going to lose players again. And all the goodwill that you've that you're building with with the new stuff is going to be yoinked away. Because let me tell you something: you don't piss off a a, a, a gamer more than than taking their fun away. <laughs> you, you know what I mean? Yeah. And we're really vindictive and hateful about that stuff. It's like, oh, how dare you? Well, yeah, like, I mean, there's there's been whole builds built around this this thing, you know? And it's not like it's yeah. changing the game. No, not at all. It's, it's no, just that this one thing it, happens yeah. to be able to take out fabricators. Like, a, right. like it's a spear. Like a spear right. can do the same thing. Mm -hmm. So why can't the commando? I don't know. If a spear can do it. Has something to do with armor pen or, Does it, or, or some shit. I, think I, I, I don't know. do with them being like, yeah, oh, we kind of fucked up. Should we fix it? Like, no. Yeah. No, it's just too late to fix leave it. Leave it alone. Just leave it. Leave it alone. Leave it. And uh, we're going to be upset. If, if, you, if, you, if, if, you nerf the, if you nerf the commando, then it's just another nothing that nobody's ever going to use. Yeah. So, whatever. Whatever. You know, you know make, make it 30 seconds longer to call one down or something if you're going to nerf something. But don't, you, don't don't even even do, you don't even have to do that. You don't even do that. It's fine the way it is. I haven't mm -hmm. even used it that much. Like, I used it when it first came out. Mm -hmm. uh, now I've moved on to a couple other things. Yeah. Because I'm we're on bug side, so I'm not taking out fabricators mm -hmm. anymore. So, but it's like, just leave it. It's fine. It didn't change anything. It didn't break the game when it came out. Not like, oh, I didn't know that everybody was wiping out the entire map in two seconds. Like, no, we're not. Nope. I'm still getting what, my ass kicked. <laughs> what's our uh, What's our time at? Uh, we're at 27 minutes. We've got to wrap this up. All right. Well, let's do some viewer comments. All right. Go for it. Um, okay. First viewer comment. Man, I can put my glasses on. Dutch Butters is a little old. He needs to be able to see. Is it Jay Red Eye? Um, yeah. Jay Red Eye 6889 says, get it together, guys. You're drunk and lame. I haven't even drank today yet. It's like 9.30 in the morning. I mean, I'm not going to say I've never had drinks at 9.30 in the morning in the We've studio. We've definitely had before. drinks at 9.30 in the morning. I, I would kind of like one right now. But because again, he's lucky we're not drunk and lame right now because I'd probably fire up the guy right now. But, uh, I'm just kind of not in the mood. I'm, I'm in a good mood right now. And, you know. I don't know. Been, I don't know what was I've been, up, I've I don't know what less. I don't know what was up Jay's asshole when, when he wrote this <laughs> when he wrote this comment. But you know, drunk um, and lame. Yeah. I wish. I, man. I mean, lame, sure, but drunk, yeah. not, not, I, I not could yet. Be, I could be kind of lame, but we'll, we'll we'll be drunk later. Okay. <laughs> okay. So thanks for the uh, inspiring comment. Yes, thank really you. Nice. Go ahead. Uh, the next one is from Michael Butts for seven thirty. Uh, did you hear that Arrowhead's best talent quit and opened their own studio? We'll be lucky to get the Illuminate by Christmas. Is that real? I have no idea. The best it, talent it, it, quit? But I, That doesn't that, make any sense. They just does, made a shit does, ton of money. That does happen. Sure. You know, these guys go, oh, well, you know, I'm capable of making a triple-A game, so we're going to go start our own studio. And, you know, it'll probably... Yeah, didn't they sell 12 million copies? Yeah, something like that. But so they've got money. It's not like they're not paying their people. For real. You know, but you know, I mean, I get it. You know, know, these these devs, they have their own ideas. They want to go do their own thing. So, and that's fine. And then they'll be replaced by new people. It's just it's just the way the world works, guys. No big deal. Um, as far as the Illuminate goes, um, you 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 notice that there was zero mention of the Illuminate in any of this stuff that we talked about today. Oh, with the new war bond, with the new war bond bug, and the bug, update, new bug and, anim, uh, yeah, enemies and new bot enemies. There's no I don't Illuminate. think we're gonna get the Illuminate for a while. I really don't. Did they blow their load with Meridia then? <laughs> I think they blew their load. Unless they're see, unless they're unless they're real subtle, you know. We'll see. We'll see. This, this is, is what the narrative I mean with the narrative, <laughs> yep. right? So the narrative should have been, and they should have had this preloaded. The TCS missions lead to the overgrowth of the bugs. The overgrowth of the bugs lead to Meridia Super Colony. Mm -hmm. Meridia Super Colony leads to the Black Fluid mission or Dark Fluid, whatever it was called. Black Fluid mission leads leads to the Black Hole. Black mm -hmm. Hole leads to the Illuminate. The, the Illuminate lead to the new Galactic War. Yeah. Like, they need to have this stuff in freaking ready to and roll. And like I said, they, they might have that stuff all mapped out, but I think they, 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 we might have to have the... Uh, 
the assets catch up to us. So I, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But we'll um, what's the next one? Um, I don't. This from, one's all you. I don't know anything uh, about that. From Berserk Fan Three Hundred. Speaking of pro wrestling, because I mentioned Bam Bam Bigelow last week. You yeah. Know, I sent you the picture. You did. Did you get it after I? After it? I, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's I all saw fired it. up. You know. Uh-huh. Um, speaking of pro wrestling, how about a Coco Beware emote? What is that? So Coco that. Beware is an old school '80s wrestler, mm-hmm. and he had a big parrot. And he and he did this. He had this. No, it was a real parrot that he kept on his shoulder, right? <laughs> and uh, he did this thing where he, where he flapped his wings. Oh my god! Like freaking Nacho <laughs> Libre? <laughs> kinda, kinda, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so he. I guess we want a, a, a arm flapping, <laughs> an arm flapping uh, emote, which would be kind of fun. oh, it'd be hilarious. That's a good idea. Let's do it. Eagles freedom emote. You know what I mean? Yeah. I can see that for sure. And uh, like this Nacho th- Libre. <laughs> <laughs> you can do the last one. Uh, okay, let's see. Give. How do you say that? Give Mama, Mama Jamma. I think. Whatever. Mama Jamma 3859. What? You guys need to bring sentries on open Mac? Big missions? All that open land? You guys are tweaking. <laughs> sentries are goaded. <laughs> Fair point. Yeah, he's right. Fair point. They're right. He, she's right. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't. I usually I'm so much on the run, and the cooldown yeah. times are so long for those things. I usually just don't bother bringing them. I'm I'm learning to bring a sentry every once in a while. I bring sentries if I'm playing solo. We we did uh, a mission. It was just last night actually, and uh, Beard kept on bringing the. Uh, I think it was the rocket launcher. So, and and every time a bio titan would get even close, it would just destroy it. It was it was pretty awesome to watch. So a rocket, uh, it was a, a wild time, a rocket, or it rocket was, time? it was, it was, it was one of the, one, I forget which one it was, but it was one of the centuries. It was mm-hmm. one of the big getter ones. It might, it might, it was a rocket launcher or the, I don't think it was the a auto launcher. It might, mm, might've been auto cannon, auto cannon, but it was cool. Nice. And, uh, you know, the other thing too, that always, always freaking happens to me on bug missions is I'll put a sentry down and a fucking charger will pop out of nowhere and blow the shit. Yeah. Up. It's annoying. And, um, and then I got four minutes to wait for the next one to come down. So, so that's why I don't usually pack sentries mm-hmm. unless i'm really in like i know exactly where i'm going to put it and i know it's going to be safe and this and that but if i just throw a sentry down somewhere guarantee you dude yeah. i'll be shooting some bugs over here and some charger or some titan will walk right up to it and freaking flat mm-hmm. and it'll be gone and i'll yeah. be i'll be fucked so that's why i don't right. bring sentries but anyway well, that's cool let me uh i do have one thing i need to address really quick Hit um me. uh and uh, this is going to be finished before I go home today. This is my goal. Um, we had to comment last week about about uh, Apple um, Podcasts and Spotify. Okay. Um, all of our episodes, including this one, will be up on Spotify by the end of today. So I'm just saying, uh, we got about I got about six more episodes I need to upload. Okay. So Spotify is a go. Nice. I don't I don't know about Apple yet. That I'm kind of like throwing that on your lap. So, oh, okay. Um, but um, Apple's a pain in the ass. To freaking do. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Anything, I don't know anything about it. You have to have an Apple ID, and then we already have our other podcast on the Apple ID. Right. It's gets weird. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Though. But uh, but Spotify is a go, guys. If you prefer to watch these on Spotify, please do so. And comments are open over there. So uh, we're we're good. We're good on we're, the Joe Rogan app, the Spotify. A lot of good stuff on there. I like I like Spotify. I use it every day. So. And that's uh that's all I got this week. Cool, it was crazy kind of a week. I was a little bit stressing yesterday about us having things to talk about, but man, they every through. Tuesday they always drop a bunch yeah. of topics for us, which yeah. is cool because it helps us make podcasts for people. But thank you guys so much. Hope you enjoyed the show. Oh, what's up? Discord. Go to saltinerdiscord dot com and join up with the community. We have a lot of AAA players over there uh, that are diving every day. Yep. So if you're if you're struggling to find friends to play with because there's lower player count. Come over to saltinerdiscord.com. We've got a good group of people over there to hang out with and, and to drop with. And like I said, there's a lot of AAA players over there. So if you're looking to grind XP and you need those 15, 1700 XP missions, come hang out with us. Yep. We'll get you set up. All right, folks, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. We'll see you next week. Stay salty.